The Pacers have reached the back stretch, and they are underway. Bin John Yankee down at the pylon, starting well. Cruz Hanover just to his outside is stride for stride with him. Now a slight lead for Bin John Yankee. Joe Mickey or so fine settles in third, two and a half off the lead as uh, up front of there. Bin John Yankee asserts himself for a clear lead. Fourth is Fireball Freddy, followed by Nope Wasn't Me and the early trailer Faithful Duel. Bin John Yankee goes off stride, goes uh, skirting into the infield there. Everybody behind avoided the trouble. As they come to the quarter in 27 and 3, they head past the party patio, and Bin John Yankee leads the way by a length and a quarter over Joe Mickey or so fine. Looking for his second straight in the series is the 1 to 2 favorite. It's about three back to Fireball Freddy in third. Nope Wasn't Me was an upset winner last week in the first leg of the Weiss. He's fourth and moving to the outside early for Anthony Napoleon. Politano, then Faithful Duel, and Cruz Hanover still kind of off stride at the back and slowing up. Ben John Yankee on top comes to the half mile marker in 56 and 4, 29 and 1 second panel. On to the back stretch, Ben John Yankee has led since the jump. Allard not asking for much on the outside. Nope, wasn't me trying to reel him in as now the pace intensified. Joe Mickey or so fine holding on to second, two lengths back. It's a big gap to Fireball Freddy, fourth to the outside, Faithful Duel, and way back uh, to the trailer that is uh, Cruz Hanover. And uh, Nope, wasn't me went back in to save ground here. Ben John Yankee, a lead it by a solid length and three quarters. Three quarters, 124 even, 27 and one in the back. It's been Ben John Yankee all the way. Joe Mickey or so fine, a length and a quarter away. It's about two and a half more to third. And a, a nope wasn't me, well back to Fireball Freddy fourth. Top of the stretch, Ben John Yankee looking to seal the deal. Opens the lead up to three now. Joe Mickey or so fine, widening, has to ga gather momentum quickly. Here he is. Ben John Yankee leads. Joe Mickey or so fine, will he get there? He will not. Ben John Yankee all the way on the front end for Simon Allard. Joe Mickey, you are so fine, comes up just short. It was Nope, wasn't me, third. Fireball, Freddie, fourth. Ben John Yankee, six to one here today in 151 and two. Oh, we mentioned Simon Allard choosing off the Joe Mickey or so fine who won last week in this class. Ben John Yankee finished third. And uh, here he goes with Ben John Yankee quickly out to the front end. Held a solid lead for the second half of the mile at the very end. Watch now as Joe Mickey or so fine comes out. He kind of widens before he really gets his momentum gathered. And that little bit of hesitation makes a big difference late because you're going to see Joe Mickey or so fine come into the picture, but too late for the win, uh, binge on Yankee here. Judges have posted the unofficial order of finish for race number four. Number one, binge on Yankee finished first. Number four, Joe Mickey or so fine finished second. Number five, nope, wasn't me finished third. And number two, Fireball Freddy finished fourth unofficially one, four, five, two in race four. Heading back to the Hanover Shoe Farms winner's circle, unofficial winner of today's fourth race, first division of the Weiss. Number one, Ben John Yankee, three-year-old Bay Colt by Stay Hungry, out of bootleg, a Yankee by All-American Native, bred by Charles Keller III of Maryland, owned by Burke Racing Stable, Fredericktown, Pennsylvania, Brad Grant, Ontario, Canada, Lawrence Carr, Randolph, New Jersey, and Weaver Buscemi of Cannonsburg, PA, Ron Burke.